Shakespeare said, journeys end in lovers meeting. However, garden's journey never ends. It goes back centuries and centuries ago. In its pathways, people have created different gardens, such as formal garden, uh, roses garden, vegetable garden, butterfly garden, country's garden, Asian garden, and many and many other gardens. The beauty of a formal garden are the perfect symmetry, the pathways, the geometric shapes, and if the focal point are statues, fountains, a bench, a big vase, or other ornaments. All these four pathways bring you to the focal point, which is a geometric shape, and uh, in the focal point, it is the fountain. Where we live in New England, it is very important to have color and energy, even in the harsh winter. And it is nothing more beautiful than these yellow bushes. When it is snowing, they have the same color. These bushes are called golden unimes. And carrying all the elements of this formal garden, I created another part. It is very important. Even though we have color all the winter, we have green, it is very important in other seasons to add more colors particularly in summer. Roses are perfect bushes that add color in summer because they bloom from May or June to October. Don't be afraid to be, to be spontaneous. As you see, it is a pathway here which brings you to another geometric shape, which is a rectangle and the focal point is a table with two chairs. It is so beautiful that all these, you, these uh, roses, all this energy have covered the pathway. Journeys end when lovers meet. However, journey's garden never ends. I'm Valbona Lavdari. Garden is one of my passion. If you like this video, don't hesitate to subscribe. Thank you.